Dear friends and colleagues, I'm sorry I can't be with you today in Lisbon, but I am grateful for the opportunity to engage with this important event and I thank the team at DGRTD for inviting me to participate. Ireland, as the EU's only island member state in the Atlantic, shares global concerns around climate change and its impact on our oceans, and we recognise the urgent need for action. We also recognise that the solutions to our climate challenges can lie also within the seas and oceans. The need for research to provide these solutions is evident, and I'm proud that Ireland's newest research ship, the Tom Crean, will be completed this summer. This will be a great addition to our fleet of research ships, supporting the work of our Marine Institute and, in turn, this mission. Ireland is ready to support the implementation of the EU mission Restore Our Oceans and Waters by 2030 and to adhere to the mission's charter launched here today at the UN Ocean Conference. We acknowledge the value of this charter and the direction it provides us as member states and stakeholders. By adhering to the Mission Charter, Ireland can gain access to knowledge, services and tools the Mission Ocean and Waters will deploy through the European Digital Twin Ocean, the Mission Implementation Platform and other coordination actions at sea basin level. We see our engagement with the Mission as mutually beneficial. Together, Ireland and the EU stand to gain from a strong Irish commitment to the Mission and we encourage other member states, regions and stakeholders to, to discover this charter and to engage with actions for the successful implementation of the mission and its lighthouses. The, the lighthouse under this mission in the Atlantic Arctic will strengthen our cooperation with our European neighbours and international partners to jointly restore the Atlantic Ocean. We hear the call being sent out by this mission and its lighthouses and as an island that is home to world-class researchers, we are certainly ready to answer that call.